Hello and welcome to the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Manchester City facing Brighton and Hove Albion. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Number 17, And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson stands between the posts. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. And a look at the lineup for Brighton. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. Thank you for attending the Etihad Stadium. Enjoy the match. And now they get the ball rolling. Well, that's a super ball over the top. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Holland. Poor pass. Gundogan. On to Grealish. Corner for Manchester City. They take it short. John Stones. Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. So, underway again here. 1 0 the score. Well, back. How can they make one of these passes count? And the keeper put to the test, but he comes through it. Well, he's so sharp, isn't he? Great first save, and then the recovery. A bit sloppy in possession. Well, no stopping him. And let's give credit to the defending. Can they create something from here? Well, possibilities inside the box. Mares. On to Holland. And he read it well defensively. Mares. And he might be through here. And striking the post. Determined defending. A oh, terrific pass. Well back. Well, they stopped them in their tracks.
Oh, that's a pass of high quality. And the keeper making sure that there were no straps to feed on for the attackers. Gundogan. Holland. Oh, it's in! A two-goal cushion now, and the lead fully merited. Well, here we can see just how good the cross from Grealish was, and what a finish from Holland. It gives the keeper absolutely no chance. It's such a powerful strike. The ball is moving again. 2 0 is how it stands. March. Alexis McAllister. Could cross it in here. Head over towards the back post. Couldn't hang on to it. Gross. Well, City, as the stats highlight, have had most of the ball. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Yes, yeah, really going so well for them, and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. They have to take it away. De Bruyne. On to Mares. And he takes on the shot. Determined block. March. Here's Gross. Well back. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Now sending it in. It hasn't come to very much. Chance to reduce the arrears. And a goal! Not over just yet. Well, let's see this again. Look at the bend he gets on this. That struck so cleanly. What a good finish. So back underway at 2-1, tight contest here. Stones. De Bruyne now. Well, he was in the right place to intercept. Grealish. Body in the way. Wasteful from Brighton. Holland. Crossing opportunity. Well, half time coming up shortly. City with the lead here. Stuart, how about your thoughts on what they've put into the game? Yeah, it's certainly been an open game. But on the balance of play, I think they do deserve their lead. They just have that little bit more creativity, particularly in the wide areas. Gundogan Gundogan Oh, a fine block De Bruyne Timely intervention and So back underway here into the second half
Now, let's see what they can do here. But really sticking to their task defensively. And a poor ball. Manuel Akanji. De Bruyne now. Poor pass under no real pressure. Moises Caicedo. Grealish. Stones. Holland. Not showing good patience. Real chance. And it's gone in. The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, as you can see, he's given far too much space, but he still had some work to do, and I think that's a very tidy finish. It was never in doubt. Underway again with the score at 3-1. Joel Feldman using all his defensive acumen to cut it out Holland now with Grealish superb block well great read there to intercept Holland And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Struggling to keep the ball. Holland. Beautifully disguised ball. Well, it nearly worked out. And a fine interception. Welbeck. Moises Caicedo. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Well, a chip that went awry. Well, maybe it was the right option, but his technique let him down there. And they're making a change. Manuel Akanji. Now with Mares. Gundogan. Grealish. Rodri. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Gundogan. Gundogan. Well, just a whisker wide of the post. Not a bad effort at all. A change in the offing for City. Grealish. Gundogan. Opportunity it is. Another well, classic example of how to intercept. Pascal Gross. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Well back. Oh, good work by the keeper. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Number 25, Manuel Akani. Coming onto the pitch, number 14, Henry Laporte.
Over it comes. Not really the ideal clearance. Still a chance. And at the second time of asking, it's a goal. The keeper, meanwhile, looks to the heavens. Well, here it is again. And I don't think it's good enough from the goalkeeper. You have to say that. He spilled it right into the danger zone. And at this level, you're always going to be punished. Three, two it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? A quarter of an hour remaining here. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Mares. And back with De Bruyne. And now Stones. Well cleared away. Gundogan. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. A gift for any goalkeeper. Well, they're inching ever closer, City. It's almost a victory, but not quite officially so. Stuart, interested to get your thoughts on their performance. Well, it's been great entertainment, and we've seen some excellent attacking football. But overall, I think they've been the better team. They've certainly had the greater cutting edge. Now they just need to see this out in the final few moments. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Mares. This could finish it. Brilliantly blocked. Alexis McAllister. Mitoma. And here they come, still pressing for an equaliser. Couldn't grab hold of it. And he clears it out of harm's way. Well, that was the big chance they've been looking for. And that could be the match-winning save. Well, now they've got to concentrate on keeping the door locked. Gundogan. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Well, three minutes of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. Very quick thinking there. Well back. Mares. And now Rodri. Well, there's the final whistle, and Manchester City have come out on top in this game. Your verdict? Well, we talked about their goal scoring record before the game, and they didn't let us down. That was a great display of attacking football. Mind you, it needed to be because they made some really poor mistakes at the back.